found this really great uh, recipe for uh, smoked leg of lamb, Irish style, on about.com. And here we go. Uh, this is a uh, butterfly leg of lamb. It's about uh, three pounds. And uh, what I'm doing is here, is, of course, is adding some rosemary, and I also included some garlic in inside it, uh, tying it up to uh, get it into a good shape. So we'll hold that. I'm uh, preparing everything on the rack that will go into the smoker. Um, This is the uh, Irish part, which is the potatoes, I guess. Um, I'm preparing this, uh, the, the potatoes, as you see. Uh, also, there's some peppers in there, which I selected uh, red just for the color. And uh, the notice the knife that I'm using is the uh, Chinese cleaver, which I've been using for ages. Uh, this one is probably about 20 years old. Uh, it's very inexpensive, about 20 bucks in China, almost any Chinatown. And the nice part about it is, is it takes a really great edge, and uh, it's easy to pick, thing, pick up the food, edit it, and transfer it from the board to the, uh, to the pan that you're using. And that's one of the reasons I really like it. I've uh, used it for things uh, as intricate as uh, uh, boning out uh, chicken breasts and things of that nice type. Also, actually done a, an entire boneless turkey with it. So uh, I would not use anything else but. As you will see, the vegetables, the potato and the pepper, go in underneath the um, underneath the lamb, and so that collects the juices. No oil goes into the uh, vegetables, by the way. Um, salt, pepper, that's all. And a little bit of the thyme if you want, and we're ready to go. This is a Masterworks electric smoker, which I bought uh, about a year ago, or actually almost about six months ago. And the only drawback to it is it's a little narrow as far as a full rack of ribs. However, it hasn't stopped me to making a lot of ribs. They just cut them in half and, and arrange them. The, uh, so here I am putting the lamp into the smoker. It is set, I believe it is, 225 degrees. The ribs will uh, cook for four hours at this point. Uh, you want to get them down to about, uh, uh, I'm sorry, cook to about uh, 135 degrees for medium rare. Next we're going to put in the uh, onions and peppers, which will go uh, beneath the lamb. And um, here you see me taking out the lamb and uh, wrapping it up so I can bring it in. I, at this point, it, what I did was I let it rest for a bit and uh, have to check in the temperature. Uh, the temperature at this point was at hopefully 135 degrees because I've checked it with a thermometer. And now I will uh, get off a, take out a slice just to verify that. And you can see all the juices that are on the bottom there collecting. And we have da -da -da -da, a nice looking piece of medium rear lamb. Perfect. The peppers have been taken out a little early, and the potatoes are not tender. Um, 
So what I attempted to do at this point was I let them in. Uh, they did uh, over a relatively high flame. They did collect a lot of uh, caramelization, which you'll see in a bit. I covered it for a while uh, with tin foil and added, um, as you see there, some olive oil. Um, and I added in the juices that were in the tin foil from the lamb, uh, which you saw earlier. Um, Vegetables. 